Enough time has gone by. By this time, the word is out, whatever it is. Y'all made me the poster child of this shit. With the Joe situation and the paperwork. It was explained that I got it from Star. Star, if you go to his channel, you see all the shit that's going on. You see the back talk, other people talking about it. You see that he the one who set it off. He wanted credit. He was actually getting mad because I was putting my name out there instead of him. I just shouted him out and everything I did because he's the one who, put, who broke the story. Go to MC Rec. He was doing the same thing. And they explained their own stories. How they heard the shit behind the scenes. They had the shit for months and all of that. That's things that are already facts that are on their podcast. Me, I got a IG page. So I posted the paperwork up because, yes, I wanted to find out. Was it real or not? Just like I said, I don't wish that on nobody. I don't put that on nobody. Uh, and I wish that, I hoped that it was fake myself. You know what I'm saying? Um, now, Joe answered. He explained it. He said he put his life on it. Just like I said I would do. I gave time. The other side has not responded. Which made me believe that Fat Joe's telling the truth. So the paperwork, to me right now, as it stands, is for gazing. I'm glad that I did not get put on by no fake rat name. Um, so it's a part of me that is happy. Um, besides that, I did my little home homework, and it leads to dead ends. You know, nobody came up with from the other side and explained it or gave more paperwork on it or gave stood up and said anything that was real about that paperwork and since that didn't happen it leads to Fat Joe was telling the truth man so he's not a rat he's not a snitch the paperwork is fake that's how I stand on it that's what I want I want all I want to say about it is that because at the end of the day y'all made me the motherfucking poster child of this shit and since y'all made me that, I have to say this. As a real nigga that did his own homework and wanted to find out the truth. And to me, the truth right now, as it stands, is that he cleared his name to me, according to me. You know what I'm saying? Nobody told me to say this shit. This is me, my own real nigga into investigation. I heard a lot of talks behind the scene. I heard all of this. But yo, the proof is in the pudding at the end of the day. Niggas could make people work up, especially nowadays. This is actually a great situation if you ask me Because he stood up to his To what they was accusing him of He responded It even took a little bit of time But he responded He said what he had to say And nobody answered him Nobody answered him There's no other proof The, the, the document do have empty spaces in between there Where it's You know Questionable so I wanted to find out if that was real myself. So as you see, he stood up, he faced the fire, he said his piece. And uh, you know what I'm saying? He defended himself the way he, you no, know, I would have defended myself not with that much fucking flossing and putting other stories in front of it, but he said what he needed to say. And that's what that's good with me. That's as it stands right now, that that's that's I bought that, and, and at the end of the day, I feel that he was telling the truth, and that fake, that, that's paperwork is fake. So at the end of the day, like I said, even enemies, if they real about it, they still salute enemies when they do something to stand up. So that's all I can say. My jokes and all the extra shit, yeah, the trolls at me out to do stupid, stupid shit because they was getting on my nerves. So, I, you know me, I fuck with the comedy. I fuck with the comedy, and y'all might have took it like, you know, I was extra stamping. No, I was. I wanted to find out the truth, just like everybody else. And right now, I'm good and satisfied with that paperwork not being real. Fat Joe defended it the way he should have defended it, and I believe that. And that's it. Anything else? Is everything else. You know what I'm saying? The world has a way of keeping you clean, keeping you honest. You know? That monkey wrench was thrown in his career, his life, 
and he defended it. He did it. However, we feel that, you know what I'm saying? All that extra shit he did, doesn't matter. He said it. He put his life on it. Just like I said, I would. So I can't be a hypocrite and say, oh, and keep on. Like, I'm not a hater that way. That man stood up to the fire. He said it. He got on camera. Had nothing to do with it. It was fake. You know what I'm saying? It went beyond and shit for everybody else to make him believe it. We're involving everybody else. But you know what? It sounds and it and it it, 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 it felt and it stood the test of time, according to me, that that paperwork was definitely fake. And I'm not nobody's flunky or middleman or, or a nigga who I'm not going to take nobody else's fucking, you know, shit. And stand up there acting like I did it, or, or you know what I'm saying, or or, 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 or get caught up in some shit that is somebody else's problem and it's mine. No, it's not. It was just the news that was reported. I chose to repost it, and that's what it is. This is my outcome of it. And y'all take it out. Y'all want to take it. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, part of me is really, really happy that the Terror Squad legacy could stay intact of realness, just that realness. And the other shit that pertains to mine, me, me and his beef, which shit that he did because I guess he learned later on how to do some dirty shit to your man. <laughs> as far as like, you know what I'm saying, the paperwork in, 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 in the motherfucking, uh, in the business side, you know, when it comes to the game, the hip hop game. So like I said, man, I'm good with, I'm good with what his explanation was. I'm good with the time. Niggas not responding. Niggas is acting like they don't know nothing now or they, they, they backstepping. I just looked at the, at this whole situation. I put it up. I did my little homework. Came out. Nobody nobody wanted to step up else and bring no authentic shit back to the to you know what I'm saying to to the to the to the board. Joe stood up, said what he did, um, explained the situation, and it's good enough for me, man. So Joe is not no snitch. I'm happy that he's not keeping the legacy, like I said, intact. The terror squad, once again, proud. Still mad at this nigga for the shit he did with me. You know what I'm saying? The business side. But at the end of the day, I'm kind of happy that he stood up and he represented the way he would. That's the Joe I know from back in the day. So, salute.